So happy or not really suits our customer base. There's a lot of digital solutions out there at the moment, but at the current way that people shop with us and the current way they want to feedback, this is working for us really well. Uh, my name is Julie Tyler. I work for Central Indian Co-op and I'm the Customer Experience Manager. So I'm responsible for customer feedback and customer experience in store. We're in Marston Mortain, which is one of our more recent stores. It's a beautiful new build. And um, this store's been trading in the last year and it's at the south end of our region. A colleague of mine who'd used Happy or Not before joined our team and suggested that it might work for us. If I'm honest, I was really skeptical, but I'm delighted that I've been proved wrong about how useful it's been in our business. And that was about two years ago. We're in a really competitive marketplace, so convenience in the UK is really crowded. Um, the most important thing for our customers in this size store is ease and speed, getting what they want and getting out and being able to get on with other things. So we ask questions where the situation would change. So we ask predominantly how happy were you with the queue time today, because that could be different throughout the day and throughout the week. So that means we have a lot of regular customers and it means they can answer as many times as they need to without it getting repetitive for them. It also means we can see really clearly where we've got some issues we might want to make an improvement on. So the managers can do something the next day about what they've seen. They feel supported by the business because we've sent them the machine so they can actually do something. Um, and the customers like that if there's something they're not happy with, they can see us measuring it and then they can see us correcting it.